this chunky boy here is Nibs. And today, I'm gonna try to paint him. Going into this project, I'm a little nervous, but seeing that I have my color palette ready, I figured I'd start with the basics. The background. Once I got that done, I added an outline and color blocked his body. So the dark parts are where the light hair will go, and vice versa. I am on Instagram and I post a lot of sneak peeks of fun projects that I'm working on. So if you want to follow me, I would greatly appreciate it. The link is in the description box below. I usually like my pieces to be half realistic, half cartoony. So I'm going to add a bright outline to nibs to see what that looks like and if I like it. If not, I'll change it, but might as well try it. After adding the outline, I don't hate it, but I'm hitting a creative wall, so I'm gonna call it a day and see what happens tomorrow. I'm sure other artists and painters do this, but I found that whenever I make a stupid mistake, I just use water and usually that kind of erases it, but only if the paint is still wet. I'm having a little trouble getting the detail on his nose, so I'm mixing my mediums and using a pen to get the little details of the bumps on the nose. Following the same method, I'm using a white pen to bring out a wiry look in some of his hair. I thought his tongue was going to be the easiest to paint, but it's turning out to be the hardest. <laughs> I spent like two hours on this already and it still looks like a lollipop, but I'm going to keep painting it until I get it.
for the hardest part, text. <laughs> And as if I didn't torture myself enough the first time, I'm going to outline the same text. And now for the final reveal. And here it is. I have to say I'm quite pleased with how it turned out. It turned out a lot better than I was expecting for it being my first attempt at painting a dog. I kind of like it. What do you guys think? What's your favorite part? Or least favorite part? I'm kind of curious on both. <laughs> but I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe. It really helps a lot and it lets me know if this type of content is what you want to see. And if you know of anyone that might enjoy this, please share it with them. I would greatly appreciate it. But yeah, thanks for watching.